Welcome back and thank you so much indeed for staying with us as we continue to tell your story. Now, Police Minister Becky Kele says he's asked his senior officials to be tough on members of the anti-gang unit accused of corrupt practices. Two members uh, recently of the recently established unit in the Western Cape appeared briefly in court on theft and assault charges. They were arrested following an investigation into claims that they stole money from a house in Beacon Valley in Mitchell's Plain. The anti-gang unit was established to fight the scourge of gangsterism on the Cape Flats. It's part of an intervention strategy by police to make communities safer. But this morning, two of their own faced the long arm of the law. 35-year-old Lindani Chinyanga and 38-year-old Nombuyiso Gule allegedly took money from a house that they had raided as part of an anti-gang unit operation. The pair were allegedly captured on video, taking around 15,000 rand from a safe. They were arrested before the unit was deployed to patrol on Wednesday. They had some form of arrogance of wanting to bribe the owner of the house using the money they've stolen from him. <laughs> uh, and, and, and definitely you can't sympathize with those people. The two were granted bail of a thousand rand each. The matter was postponed until the 22nd of January for further investigation. Mariska Boeta, SABC News, Cape Town.